How did this rare pink manta get its color? Scientists with the Australian research group Project Manta, who study the rosy ray, have confirmed its color to be real. At first, they theorized Inspector Clouseau's color was the result of a skin infection or diet, similar to how pink flamingos get their color from eating tiny crustaceans. But in 2016, Project Manta researcher Amelia Armstrong took a small skin biopsy from the famous animal, and their resulting analyzes ruled out diet and infection as the cause. Now, Project Manta's leading theory is that the manta has a genetic mutation in its expression of melanin, or pigment, says Asia Armstrong, a research assistant for the group. And the ray is not just a cool-looking animal, it could contribute to science, Solomon David, an aquatic ecologist at Louisiana's Nichols State University, suspects the mutation is a condition called erythrism, which causes an animal skin pigmentation to be reddish, or in some cases, pink. Other more well-known genetic mutations to an animal's pigment can make them melanistic or albino. Reef mantas typically come in three color patterns, all black, all white, or black and white. The latter, which is most common, features a pattern called countershading, in which the fish has a black back and a white belly. When viewed from above, their dark backs blend in with the darker water below, and when viewed from below, their light bellies blend into the sunlit surface, a configuration generally thought to offer protection from predators, such as sharks.